hi guys hello and welcome back to another video with your girl pretty and this is pretty moment and you know what time it is this is time for another video if you're seeing this face for the first time hello my name is pretty and you are definitely welcome into this channel please just be sure to subscribe comment like and share leave your thoughts leave your opinions leave your whatever on the comment section and i'll be very sure to engage with you guys and hello from asia <laughs> i'm greeting you guys from the other side of the world i'm greeting you guys from asia in vietnam i said i am not gonna say where i was but uh, you know there's no point holding on to that uh eventually you guys will obviously get to know i know a lot of people have been thinking that i'm in china i'm not in china i'm in vietnam and i know that you're going to also wonder that why did i choose vietnam over china if you know guys i've stayed in china for three good years i just wanted to give vietnam a chance and also for those that will say but vietnam doesn't pay for me it pays honey for me it pays it also depends on your experience and also what is payment for you what is good check for you so what is a good check for you might not be a good check for me and what is a good check for me might not be a good check for you but for me at this point i have a good check okay okay so this is not about checks and all that it's about my apartment tour which i'm about to give you guys and before i do that i just want to give you guys a bit of details about this apartment so this is a bachelor what we call a bachelor in south africa it's um, mainly for one person okay it's like okay for me it's suitable for me in China I've lived in a two-bedroom apartment which sometimes I get to be scared because it's huge I love this I love 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 I definitely love this guys I'm not far from Hanoi I don't know the name of the city maybe I'll go ahead and attach the name but I don't know the name of the city yet but it's just like 30 minutes drive from Hanoi with a car with a bike it's almost an hour drive from Hanoi and another details about this apartment is that it's 7 million Vietnam dong, which is equivalent to 5.5, if not close to 6,000 rand, and is fully finished with Wi-Fi, water, and electricity bill included. So another thing that I'm going to do also is to give you guys a tour of the rooftop, okay? I'm going to take the rooftop and also attach into this clip and give you guys this video. I hope you guys will like it. I hope you guys will enjoy it. I took down most of my videos for a reason. So I feel like this is a fresh start. This is a new start for me. And if you want to walk this journey with me, if you have questions about Vietnam, if you know this is where business is, this is where, you know, money is. So you have questions already, I know. Drop those questions in the comment section or you can still connect with me on IG on um, forever underscore pretty and i'll be sure to engage and answer all your questions but for now go ahead and watch i'll see you next time okay Bye. guys welcome to my apartment tour so this is the lift here coming out of the lift you come to my door okay so when you open the door the first thing you see on your right is this beautiful cupboards I feel like this thing is kind of like zoomed. Oh, okay. Yes, this is what I want. Okay, so when you open here, the first thing is this beautiful cupboard here. Guys, I've already stocked my noodles. If you know me and this Chinese noodles, so I've already stocked in my noodles. I bought, uh, this is what I ate yesterday. Oh, okay. This is my breakfast, guys. My muesli. If you know, you know that I love muesli. This is my muesli that I came with from South Africa and these are my noodles that I've stocked up and yeah, there's just enough space. These are my spices that I came with from South Africa and I bought that olive oil here, salt and milo. I also bought those onions here already, you guys, because this is like my day three or if not day two. So we have enough space in this kitchen. Um, if you open here even though i don't have plates meaning i have to buy plates guys the only thing i don't have is plates because what's this yeah so we have enough uh, space to store whatever that we want to store and going down here we have um this one plate i don't know why it's one plate why okay so this thing is not focusing and i'm gonna get pissed okay good okay so we have this stuff here it's just one plate and i don't know why it's one plate you guys see the eggs i bought yesterday and i don't understand if these are chicken eggs or duck or whatever but i bought them and i was like i'm not even gonna touch them 
because what's this but i see collapse we are still on the house tour so yeah coming uh coming from the cupboards going down let me just go back a bit so that i can give you guys a few view so yeah this is how the cupboards up look then we have a rice cook a rice cooker english this one over there uh chinese and vietnamese this is their number one i like it's a must have in the kitchen then going down there we have like the sink and as you go down there we also have the washing machine and more space to store uh whatever that you want to store i think they did have give me some pots and whatever here um yeah they did give me pots so the only thing i don't have is plates okay so yeah this is um the outside and then i close my door so yeah let me let me let me look for safety i beg okay so now uh switching to your left side uh this is what you see obviously there's a door here maybe let me close close and open it okay so when you look into your left space we have this beautiful door that leads into the bath room okay so like i said this is like a bachelor space you guys the only thing i am mad of tell me i'm an african without telling me i'm an african because this sponge will, will leave your bag your body scrumptious like it will wash your bag guys I, I couldn't leave it i had to take it with me okay so the only thing i am mad uh about here is this shower because it drops exactly uh the water on the floor okay i'm mad about this and i don't know this is their style because even in china it was uh something similar to this i already took my shower guys obviously my some of my stuff they're there and over here it's the toilet and why am i not screaming because this toilet is the toilet that i want not that they are peat toilet if you know what i'm talking about they normally use those squatting toilet and i hate them with everything in me i couldn't survive a squatting um a squatting oh did i just say squatting squatting <laughs> okay a squatting toilet okay so yeah so this is the toilet and i love this space oh my god it's so cute i love it it's it's beautiful and of course Another thing I want to show you guys, I was laughing when I was doing this. So I was looking for a way to place my um, toothbrush. One thing about Colgate, first of all, let's give it to Colgate, guys. One thing about this, their toothbrush, your teeth will be clean, white, sparkling. It's so strong. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's like Ghanaians and Nigerian toothbrush. They are so strong and they will wash your teeth. But anyway, we're not there. So I want to show you guys something. You see this thing? And this is for my skipping rope you guys so i bought the skipping rope for my exercises and i came with it here and after opening this thing i was like okay so i was about to go through it and i was like i don't have anything to place my toothbrush and my my colgate just for it to be kept like in a proper way not me turning it into with this isn't it cute guys just uh, for now now you know we just got here so we have to we have to work with what we have so i had to even leave this part so that if, in case i want to throw something i can still throw but yeah guys so there we have me i had to tie this this towel because i wasn't wearing anything just wearing my sport bra because i just finished doing the skipping so we have a cute mirror over there and we have this basin and these are my earrings i was wearing yesterday coming from work so yeah that's basically it this is what the bathroom looks like so now um let me close the door and I take you also to this cupboard next to the door. So up, up, up there we have a space that obviously I'm not even going to open. Here I've already played some of my stuff. We have more storage. So these are my toiletries bag, okay? So here we have my toiletry bag. There are three. There's another one inside the brown one. The brown one plus this transparent one. And this is my side bag. If you know this bag, you know. And this is my Wi-Fi. This is where they placed the router. And this is where I placed this wicked bed that I beg. I say bed. This bag that I bought from Or Tambo for 400 Rand. I was mad. But like the bag is cute, you guys. The bag is cute. I love this side print. This one. 
it's, it's kind of cute for 400 rand i had to buy it you see it still has like the tag there i had to buy this bag because my luggage was extra so i needed to take some few kgs down okay so i bought that bag 400 rand i was mad i'm still mad going down guys obviously here you'll see my shoes i bought these shoes guys in south africa before leaving i was just like i saw this boot i was like this boot this boot in winter when my jean put this boot on stop playing stop playing it's still new i never wore it i only tried it on once and i'm ready for winter i'm set this boot is mad don't sleep on this boot it might look crazy right now because obviously i'm not wearing it but this boot is mad okay i bought them in sa so i placed my shoes here because obviously this place is for shoes storage okay so i've placed my shoes over there we have the wedges we have the nike we have my black heels my black and white heels uh, platforms okay we have my sandals over there we also have my adidas sneakers over there these are the only pairs that i came with obviously i'm gonna buy more one thing about me i know i'll buy i have my lacosta slides over there so now from so it's from the kitchen right so coming from the kitchen you enter straight into the bedroom of course we do have like a sliding door a situation happening here so there is this door that goes to the room okay let me show you guys there is this door that goes into the room which is like a sliding door so now let's go ahead and open and enter the room so another thing that i'm mad about when it comes to this room is the fact that the fridge is inside the room i feel like the fridge should have been in the kitchen so here we have this sharp product fridge okay so this is how the fridge looks uh, this is how the fridge looks and up there obviously we have an iron which i've already opened to iron my clothes yesterday when i was going to work obviously wrote in vietnamese and when you look this side we also have i think this should this will be like a 40 something inch tv i'm not sure if not close to 50 but it's quite big so yeah we have a beautiful tv over there and obviously a small table see my bread they were by yesterday i don't know if i'm ready to eat their bread here or not and we have a, a two a chair there we have chairs oh my god we have chairs we have a table there uh i think that's a dining situation over there okay my slippers i bought cash from mr price for maybe 100 rand or so my beautiful slippers i never wore them so yeah guys we have this uh dining table obviously for me and my friend or whoever that visits me and we have this situation happening there obviously you're still seeing me with my towel so this is more like a green tea okay which doesn't even taste nice it's it's a green tea it doesn't taste nice at all compared to the chinese green tea that i know on going on guys going on going on going on we have my bags that i just placed there because i don't know where to place them and have that beautiful cute little 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 table over there and we have this couch stroke chair whatever situation that is happening over there which i like i like it it's cute okay so we go to this my defining scrumptious delicious curtain i love it guys i love this curtain i love 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 it's giving quality it's giving classy it's giving beautiful it's giving everything that it has to give and going up there we have a fan already it's blowing fresh air okay and up there we also have an ac so while we're still there let's go to the side where we have mirror guys one thing about me please don't judge me okay please don't judge me please <laughs> so okay so one thing about me when i have an obsession i have an obsession and i'm saying that because of those perfumes that you are seeing they i don't know how many i bought guys i don't know how many i bought but this perfume smells really good okay so we have a young mirror there of course we have um a study table and a chair for me to do my work uh obviously that's my laptop my head my headsets and we have obviously 
different uh, types of shades the ones that I use for reading the ones I use for styling and whatever I just went ahead and placed some of my stuff and check out those perfume one two three four I had to buy them I don't know how many I bought but these perfumes the 60 run perfumes I saw this from Sam is it Samu or who what the girl is on on, on YouTube and she she gave a review on this perfume and I tried them out and ever since I never went back and also what is traveling without your Vaseline you have to always make sure that your lips are you know well moisturized this is my Vaseline this is my Vaseline this is my Vaseline and this guys this you see this I don't know why I didn't buy a new one if you don't know this then I don't know what you're doing with your life this is a Nikki Balm it's a Nigerian um, product your cough your cold your whatever doesn't have anything on this thing okay if you have that you put this in water and steam or maybe like me that is now back to work working with kids and stuff having this you guys will change your life because when you come back your legs are hot and stuff you just put that stuff rub it on your body my sister my brother your life will change over here i just went ahead and throw in different types of makeup see a lot of makeup here guys so it's just a drawer there which i'm supposed to store my work stuff but i don't store makeup over here i've stored my jewelries i've stored my eyelashes and uh my medication guys if you know i live with hypertension so guys i'm taking pills for hypertension god forbid i don't live with hypertension sure it will shall go i'm taking juramine guys i want to slim if you see the waist just know juramine is doing the work i have allergics for my eyes because my eyes were itchy of late and these are the pills for hypertension which happened during pregnancy these are the pills for hypertension also and these are for anxiety sometimes i have panic attacks so i once in a while if i have panic attack i take this okay so here also this one's the hypertension pills this one uh it's hypertension pills and you know also for bloated stomach or whatever and ladies please don't tell them what this is don't tell the men what this is okay i just uh my bag but you know before i would just say my carry them now in case of in case city in case of emergency okay so yeah so here i had a lot of my jewelry which i'm yet to sort out and just my eyeliner and other stuff guys this is not what i'm showing you it's about room tour okay so yeah and that's it from this corner which i love i'm obsessed with this corner i am very very obsessed let me give you guys a full view of that corner you see how beautiful it's cute it's nice and then we come to the main space okay which is the bed so this is uh, i think this is a queen size bed um i would obviously get uh what's this i'll obviously get bed sheets to to dress it to look more nicer but also this is not bad gray one thing about gray gray will define a space so guys there's nothing wow about this place but it's giving what it has to give okay so yeah um yeah, this is the bedroom space you guys going over there i have my bible i have my journal i have my ipad and i have my book you guys know i started reading this book in one of my videos so even though i took down all my videos but in one of my videos i did show you guys that i bought a book that one so yeah guys and i have enough space for my clothes obviously i've hanged my clothes already why is this thing not opening the proper way okay i've hanged some of my shirts my jackets and everything here over here i've packed guys literally i've packed even though the packing is not like a proper proper packing but i just unpacked my bags and just throw in here okay so yeah guys um that's basically it let me give you guys this side view uh, of the bed side and the wardrobe side before i show you outside okay so this is what this site looks like let me let it focus i don't know why it's not focusing because it makes me sick whenever it does that yes okay so this is what it looks like from here can you see the kitchen side that's my my bin there over there okay so that this is the carbon space with the cupboard space which is very very enough for me and this is the bed guys the apartment is honestly not bad now <laughs> i remember 
uh, Ebuka said to me, how is the view of the house? When I showed him the apartment while I was still in South Africa, they sent me the apartment. He was like, how is the view? View is very important. It's important. So the view, here we go. The sliding is open. So yeah. So the view, it's, it's, it's not giving what it has to give, but it's giving, you get. So this is the view, you guys. Um, I'm not mad about it. I'm honestly not mad about it. Uh, compared to when I was coming from the airport and I was seeing those places, I was like, did they carry me go where? I don't know. What is this now? Where are they carrying me to? But this place is so peaceful. Trust me. Like, let me just keep quiet a bit, you guys, and just listen. Can you hear how quiet and peaceful and one thing i love about these people they will fly their flag very high look at that flag everywhere you go in vietnam you will see their flag flying very high another one if you can see from this space in between can you see it there over there so i'm not really also mad about the view uh it's okay it's peaceful the fact that it's peaceful i think like it's fine i love that apartment this one this particular one i love it so much and it's also owned by the same landlord but also my apartment is so cute you guys i'll show you the reception um view and also uh maybe the streets when going out to work i'm expecting a friend that is already coming over one thing about me i'll make friend i already made the lady at the airport and she's coming over to my place and that's because also she borrowed me money because apparently here they don't accept rents and your girl came with a lot of friends and they couldn't exchange them for me see them with their scooter one thing about these people and their bikes five and six so that's also what i take to work so i'm about to learn how to drive but when i was coming here they don't smash person i see person die oh. they don't hit them from from scooter see another flag down there so the flags are everywhere so yeah guys that's basically it honestly there's nothing to write home about this place of course there is what am i saying this place is giving centurion it's giving midrand it's giving okay so this is me sitting on my bed so when i'm sitting on top of my bed this is what i see outside okay i don't know what the f is going on with those flowers there but i'm sure that's their deco i'm honestly not mad about this whole setup i'm not mad about it it's like it's peaceful and um yeah you guys i think on uh on the intro i would have given you guys the the price of this place which is uh seven million vietnam dong equivalent to 5.5 .5 to six thousand rands okay so yeah um yeah guys that's basically it let me know what you think about this apartment like i said in china i've stayed in like two bedroom uh apartments and stuff guys they are just so big the fact that i'm alone this is nice and peaceful I'm, I'm i'm very 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 satisfied honestly i'm not mad about anything so i think the next tour will be me taking you guys to my company showing you guys the school that i work for um i don't know when but i'll do that i'll surely do that so guys let me know what you think about vietnam uh would you like to live in vietnam would you try it uh what do you think what do you think uh they over there where the truck is it's giving lagos can you see bananas can you see those uh banana plants or banana trees is it a tree or is a plant banana it's giving legos there it's giving legos 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 it's giving plantain so yeah guys that's basically it from me to you let me just chill and wait for this lady i have to go to work around after 12 i'll leave the house to 1 30 um 12 30 so i can get to the office around one and there's a few things that i need to get done then i have classes until late at night and we are planning to go out to hanoi to groove i don't know how it's gonna work because tomorrow i'm still working but we'll figure it out okay okay i am signing out from vietnam asia there's a lot to share guys there's a lot i'll tell you guys why i changed my mind how did i get here how i applied and everything if you want to know just let me know in the comment section and obviously i won't be greedy with the information what about one thing about me 
i will share okay i'll share all the details that you want to know about getting to vietnam getting a job how much are they paying uh because i know some people will say no vietnam they don't pay they don't pay for you maybe because but me remember i spent three years in china that's not a play honey that's not a joke honey it counts for something okay so yeah guys this basically it uh this is the house tour uh, let me see from the room if i can still see that kitchen properly but yeah and that's basically it i hope you watched till the end and i hope you like it and i'll see you on my next upload stay tuned for more content guys in this vietnam because it's about to go bananas bye okay guys so this is the outside tour of you whatever you want to call it i'm just showing you guys outside so you see how peaceful this place is but banana plenty or no be small thing a plenty 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 so this is my street so quiet so quiet banana oh banana so yeah that's very quiet and this is my own apartment where i live this is the entrance and uh this is the building it's long guys i can't take you up 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 there so i'm outside i'm waiting for a friend the lady i met at the airport so yeah this is the entrance when you come in to the apartment so this is like the reception you can chill here it's so chilled like so chilled look at those beautiful flowers yeah so this is the reception and uh here we have this beautiful frame the paint is beautiful so yeah just basically it's the staircase here and uh, over there is the lift and here is where they keep bikes guys they say i have to get a motorbike to use so these are the bikes they use to travel to work in other places so yeah guys that's just basically it i'm gonna go ahead and sit here i think the only thing left now is for me to show you guys the it's for me guys to show you guys the the rooftop so yeah that is it guys there's someone that will appear here let me let me hold like this ah but it's like the person is going up or it's coming down yeah you guys will see the person now so apparently they say here they don't greet people you guys they say here when you see someone you just pass so they say you don't do good morning good afternoon good evening they say it's not even your parents when you wake up in the morning you don't greet them me being an african you wake up you don't greet your mother your father the slap where they will give you chop your brain will reset so yeah guys that's basically it i'll show you guys my new friend when she gets here she should be here in a minute or so so bye